back to my channel and uh, my name is Tayo and my channel is called Graceful Notes and um, someone mentioned to me that I haven't mentioned my name before I think I have anyway but just in case you didn't watch that video my name is Tayo spent T-A-Y-O Tayo so yeah and I do videos relating to skincare makeup lifestyle weddings and um, yeah you're welcome to subscribe to my channel I really love to have you here again and to my returning subscribers, I say thank you very much for stopping by yet again today. Today's video is about skincare, my skincare routine for over 40s. In fact, you can start you can start doing this from the age of 30 really, or even younger if you, if you really want to. Um, yeah, because the products are just products that help to maintain your skin elasticity. elasticity. Yes, so that's what it is. And um, yeah, so that's what I do. So what I've done, I've already taken off all my makeup, if you can see, I've cleaned that out. And I tend to use the long comb makeup remover, this one. Yeah, this is what I, I use to take off my, I don't know if you can see that, take off my makeup. So I've done that already. And then I went ahead, I'm going to insert a clip now of what I use. This is a B Venom face mask. And it actually does sting it stings a lot but it's a very good face mask it contains collagen and elastin which are products that you need or proteins in your skin that you need to replenish especially when you start getting older so those are the two proteins that help to make, maintain your skin and make it look go back to its normal position and make it look really plump and smooth so, but as we got, get older we tend to lose a lot of collagen and protein so this ma face mask I heard about this through um, another YouTube video what it is is I actually had a sample a tiny sample of another face mask sent to me when I bought some products and I had it at home for a very long time I didn't use it and then one day I just put it on my face and it really stung that one was called Bin Benigma I'll leave a link for it below so I used that on my face and I really felt the effect on my face straight after using that. But I looked at the price and it was about a hundred and something dollars and I said, oh well, there's no way I'm buying that for my face. So I looked for alternatives and I came across this one. This one is the another one from Lanocrine. Lano yeah, I think that's what it is. Lanocrine. I'm going to have to look at my glasses. Yeah, Lanocrine. So what I did was I, I looked at that one too and I could only get it on eBay and it was about £15 which I didn't really mind spending money on if it was going to last for a long time but then I wasn't sure on eBay, you really don't know all the time if you're getting the right thing. So I just left it anyway. So one day, I was just a few weeks ago, I was just walking into, I just walked into TK Maxx. TK Maxx is a shop in the UK where you get lots of different brands bringing their products, they bring all their products into that shop and then they sell them at really reduced price so you can go in there and get really nice products at a very very reduced price and i wasn't even looking for this i was just looking around just to see what there was and i wasn't really going to buy anything but then i just saw this and that was the price on it i don't know if you can see 5.99 and i said oh wow this looks like exactly the one i i was looking at on ebay and i definitely i went ahead and i bought it straight away and it's really good it really is good it's it's it has the effect of making your skin as i said before look plump it contains elastin collagen now let me read some of the other but let me read out all the other ingredients it contains so it says b venom stimulates the product b venom stimulates the production of natu naturally occurring collagen and elastin creating a tightening and smoothing effect it has some warnings it causes stinging do not use if you have a bee allergy and that is really important if you have a bee if you are allergic to bees do not use this it's not suitable for sensitive skin patch testing prior to use is recommended keep out of reach of children and a patch test what a patch test is it you just take a little bit of it put it on a piece of cotton wool leave it uncovered for about 45 minutes and then after if you go back and you see that you have redness or soreness or any reaction then do not use this do not use this um yeah it contains it's enriched with active manuka honey propolis collagen and elastin and then um, yeah what it is is you apply it sparingly to your skin and your neck 
and I leave it on for 15 minutes. You're meant to do this once or tw tw twice a day, morning and evening if possible. I, I tend to do it maybe once in two, three days and I definitely don't do it twice a day. But yeah, if you have the time to do that, you can. But it really does work. And so after washing that off, obviously I, I need to go in with a toner to just restore my skin's pH. And the one I tend to use is this Garnier Rose Water Toner. So I just apply a little bit of that on my face and just soothe, make sure I soothe my skin, make it, it also removes any excess impurities or makeup residue which I don't think I can have after applying that be very on face mask and washing it off but just in case normally if I didn't if I don't use my be very on face mask I would have used this cleanser and I bought this while I was on holiday and um yeah this is a also a cleanser that you can use to cleanse your skin I find oh, this is really good as well it's um very thick I'll just show you what it looks like yeah that's what it looks like so I apply a bit of that so I'd have used that to cleanse my skin if I hadn't done used my mask but because I used my mask I don't need to use that so then I, after that I go in with my so my next thing would be to put some oil under my eyes so I said to you in my last video about um, the video I did on my foundation routine it's really good to put some oil under your eyes because it tends to get dry that's one part of your skin where the one part of your your body where the skin is very thin so it tends to get really dry so I put some oil under my eyes and this is the Fasali oil which is infused with gold particles yeah so I tend to use that mostly at night you can use it during the day as well but I tend to use it most at night I think it works better for me I notice that it helps my skin look really fresh and moisturize in the morning when I make up when I wake up so I put a powder on my under my eyes and then I go in with my night cream which is the long comb gel visionaire so I'm gonna read out what the long comb what it claims to do the visionaire beauty sleep perfector so it says our our one gel in oil beauty sleep perfector that works throughout the night and helps transform the skin's look and feel night after night as of the first morning skin feels softer suppler and looks nourished in four weeks skin's radiance appears revitalized and its elasticity feels boosted for restored bounce back and I've been using this now for a few weeks and I can say that I have noticed I have noticed a change in my skin many people use so many different creams but I don't really need to do that I don't have time really and this work perfectly for me so you do what works for you actually you don't have to follow somebody else's routine over the years I've just realized that this is what works for me and yeah so just apply that and uh, my skin feels really really soft already and soothe and smooth so I just apply that that's it basically and then um, yeah the important thing is to make sure you're also taking supplements in your diet collagen and elastin lots of vitamin C as well which also helps in the production and um, yeah so that's what I do anyway Thank you very much for watching my video and I hope you subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Please comment, let me know what you like to see. If you want me to do more skin routines, I'll do my, this is my night routine. I intend to do my morning routine as well. And which other products you would like me to review, if I can get my hands on them, I definitely will. And then yeah, thank you so much for your comments, I really enjoy reading them. And then, um, yeah, I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.